What's up everyone? So today I decided I was going to make a video on how to remove a keycap on a mechanical keyboard. Um, it's actually very simple. Uh, I know when I first wanted to do this, I was a little hesitant because I was afraid, oh, what if I mess up the keycap, if I break it, something like that. But honestly, it's a very simple process. Don't worry too much. Um, so first off, you need one of these tools. Usually they come with mechanical keyboards. Um, they're pretty standard. All you do, so this is, just, I hope you can see this pretty easily. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna put it so that it is aligned on top, and then you're gonna push it down. And you're gonna wanna make sure it's snugly on. I kinda have to wiggle it a bit to make sure it actually gets on. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna wanna hold the keyboard in place and then kinda wiggle it off. And it comes off pretty easily usually. And um, you'll notice that the pattern on the inside is just a plus like the, the switch itself. So now I'm just gonna pull this through. So let's say you wanted to put on a new keycap or you just wanted to pull this off real quick and wanted to check the switch or something or you were replacing the switch. So now all you have to do to put it back on, you literally just align it and you just push it back down and it'll stay on. Perfect. So it's really not difficult to do. I will warn you though, um, when you're pushing it down, you might scrape the sides a little bit. So it might leave a little mark it's no big deal, honestly. Who who really looks at the side of their keycaps? You you shouldn't really worry. But yeah, that's just a, I just really wanted to show that real quick since I review so many mechanical keyboards. I thought it'd be nice to show people how to actually use this tool. So yeah, uh, if you have any questions, leave a comment below or tweet me. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you like this video, well, please leave a like or subscribe. That'd be great. See you guys next time.